Thanks to new DNA testing, investigators finally identified the remains of a woman found buried in a shallow grave back in 2007. We are learning that deputies have a person of interest in their investigation into the suspicious death of 39-year-old Jenna Burris. News Channel 8's Justin Shecker spoke with one of her family members tonight in Sarasota. Several months ago, Claire Weedmeyer says detectives from the Sarasota Sheriff's Office traveled to his home in Maryland. They went there to inform him and his wife that human remains had been identified as the niece they hadn't seen or spoken with in 17 years. It was very uh, nerve-wracking, unsettling, uh, it was sad. It was a very bad situation, and we were in absolute shock. Every summer, he says he expected a call from his niece, Gina Burris, between their two birthdays. But in 2006, she never called him. The family tried other avenues, and uh, there, was, there was nothing. We, we couldn't get a hold of her. We couldn't find her, and we were waiting for her to come to us. Wow. And all we had was the lies he told all of us. The details what James Burris said happened to his wife, Weedmeyer won't reveal because of the ongoing investigation. The Sarasota Sheriff's Office considers the husband a person of interest. Well, I can't comment too much, but um, it's mighty strange. Your wife ends up behind your job, passed away. That's all I, I, I that bothers us so much. Deputies say James Burris worked in an auto body shop near where they found scaled remains of a woman in a wooded area of Ashton Court on February 6, 2007. It wasn't until November 2022 that investigators say they identified the remains as Gina using advanced DNA technology. They could not get a match for several years until about a year ago when they had a new type of test. And they did that, they performed that new test uh, with Gina's uh, body, and it matched with my wife. Following this major break in this cold case, Weedmeyer says the focus for his family is getting justice for Gina. I mean, I want them to arrest the person that did this and take care of it. Punish him to the maximum.